Former Vice President Joe Biden is expected to enter the race for president at a time when he is already at the top of the polls. It's a dangerous place to be and that the expectations for you are very, very high. Biden has run for president twice, campaigning in New Hampshire in 1987 and 2007. He was never the front runner and he never actually made it to primary day. He dropped out before both times. The anticipated announcement comes almost two years to the day from when speculation swirled when Biden spoke at the New Hampshire Democratic Party's 100 Club dinner. Guys, I'm not running, okay? <laughs> but a lot has changed, even more so since Biden was on the ticket with Barack Obama. He's dealing with a different Democratic Party than the one that nominated him for vice president 12 years ago. New Hampshire House Speaker Steve Shurtleff hasn't endorsed a candidate. He worked on Biden's campaign in 2007. I think uh, people are looking, among other things, for someone to bring the country together. And I think uh, Vice President Biden offers uh, that uh, hope and possibility. WMUR political reporter John DeStazo says Biden may be on top at the moment, but as we've seen with campaigns in the past, anything can happen. Where will he be six months from now, nine months from now, primary day? That's the beauty of the New Hampshire primary and uh, this whole process. We just don't know right now. The experts also expect Biden to do better this time around now that he has more experience and name recognition having served as vice president.